What's going on, YouTube? My name is Trey. Welcome to What Kind of Change. Today, we're going to be talking about Chris Chandler. You don't know who that is? That's formerly Chris Chandler. They now go by Christine Chandler. But for the sake of the video, we'll say Chris just so you know who we're talking about. So Chris, back in the day, well, he was still going by that name. Uh, now has been released from prison, or jail, that is. Uh, if you want to like and subscribe after watching this video, please do. If you don't, that's cool, too. Working our way toward the PC soundboard. You see the cash app. Let's go ahead, hop right into this. Uh, and I'll talk about the story as you're looking at the document. So as you can see, Chris Chandler, Christine Chandler, right here in Virginia, you can see the charge here. Now you're wondering, incest with own child, what's that mean? So at one point, this individual said, put on the internet for all to watch, find out by another sick individual named Bella, uh, you can go watch your stuff on that. That person is disturbed as well. This person uh, went and had relationships with their own mother. Uh, however, since that has been ha has happened, we can see right here, 9.30 a.m., no indictment presented to control. And then at 9 a.m. this morning, or 9.30 in the 9 a.m. this morning, uh, uh, on the 8th, Chris was released. Okay? You can see down here, dismissed. So all charges have been dropped. Now, this individual has quite the extensive history. And some people are not happy that this individual has been let go because the mother is, has, from what has been told and been documented, even from Christine herself, has said, hey, look, look, the mother is going through dementia. There was even a video that was out uh, that Chris had put up at one point, Christine had put up at one point. And it said, you know, it talked about the mother forgetting everything, having dementia, and really going through some mental health issues. And now we can see, and now we can see that all the charges have been dismissed. So here's my opinion on all of this. What I think at this point should happen is that I'm hoping that Virginia has it to where this individual can never go towards anybody, uh, senior citizens at all, Right. This individual has been disturbed, has put up uh, disturbing pictures of not only himself, but of under individuals, as well as this character called Sana Chu and Rosa Chu and all these other people. Uh, obviously, this person put out publicly that they were having relations with their mother. And I'm assuming that Virginia just either couldn't find everything they needed to just lock this individual up for a while. This happened back in 2021, by the way. Or they just say, you know what, we'll let them go because they're obviously disturbed, but they can no longer be unsupervised around anyone. I'm assuming Christine is never going to be able to go around their parents ever again. That's over. And that would be the right choice. Uh, uh, it, the whole story that led up to this point is obviously an issue. Um, and I will say this. Um, you notice I keep saying Christine. Originally, this was Chris Chandler. The story behind why Chris changed the name to Christine and ended up saying that they're a transgender lesbian. The entire story behind that is there's a lot going on with that. It wasn't simple. Um, this happened over a period of time, over years. Some of it came with people being trolls. Some came with making because at some point, if y'all don't remember, you know, they were really bullying Chris. They were making Chris say that he was a homosexual. They were making Chris say obscene stuff, draw, and Chris himself was drawing obscene stuff um, until eventually, you know, uh, Chris had put out a whole story saying how he had these um, homosexual fantasies and all these kind of things. Eventually came out and said that they weren't homosexual, uh, but they had always um, started dreaming of being a woman. And that is where this all eventually came into where we now see Christine Chandler. You can go watch the whole story. Once again, you can just type it on YouTube, find a commentary channel. Uh, it is uh, quite interesting to see all of this go down. Um, you know, <sighs> it's always a discussion we got to have when it comes to people on the internet. And I think that, and I know we can't police it all. I get that. But I do think at some point we can't let this kind of stuff go on when we see this stuff on the Internet. Because if you all remember, the whole Chris saga was it, it was crazy, crazy, 
disturbed individual who was an internet sensation based off of all they were doing. Maybe not known to the whole world, but definitely in the dark world of the internet. The stories, like I said, are crazy. Even the person that Chris was talking about, the Bella, the Bella story is even crazier when you go to watch that. So we had this individual released from uh, jail and I think it's, I don't think it's a good thing. Um, I obviously don't think this individual can ever be around uh, the mother or anybody of the elderly age because it just seems like at this point the mental health has really taken a toll to where this person can be manipulated and this person is obviously having disturbing thoughts, really struggling with identity and just the way it is. But, you know, um, hopefully this individual can be supervised and never be in a situation where they can do this to somebody ever again. To the mother, I'm just sick to my stomach of what happened to the mother especially being i'm um, having dementia and um, dealing with more issues can't remember what's even going on to have your own son do that to you um and to be in your presence is just it's just gut-wrenching um it is a very hard story i'm sorry i keep looking over here at the the case and just seeing that word dismissed over and over it's just you know what can you do what can you do but that's that's the story for today, and I thought I'd just get my thoughts on it. I don't agree with it, but nothing I can do. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. I'm gone.